Performing passive range of motion for one shoulder. This skill is done for patients with contractures, immobility, or weakness. If not performed correctly, it can cause increased immobility, stiffness, contractures, and inactivity. There is no extra equipment required for this skill. You will have two minutes to complete this skill. Good morning, Mrs. Johnson. I'm Nicole. I'm going to be your caregiver today. I'm just going to check Mrs. Johnson's wristband. I'm just going to do some, a few um, exercises on your shoulder and your arm. Is that okay? Okay, great. I'm going to go ahead and bring your bed up to waist level so I can protect my back. Okay, that's great. I'm going to go ahead and walk around to the other side of the bed and give you a little privacy. Okay, Mrs. Johnson, I'm just going to go ahead and wash my hands and I'll be right back. So we wash our hands. We simulate that for the state. Um, okay, Mrs. Johnson, so we're just going to expose the one arm, keep everything else warm and covered. We want to support the joint, so in this case, it's going to be the wrist and the elbow. I'm going to take your arm back by your ear three times, let me know if there's any pain. Always ask your patient about pain. So here we go. One, I'm going to bring it back nice and slow and easy. And you hold it for a second, give it a stretch. Two, any pain, Mrs. Johnson? And we have one more. And three. And the wrist and elbow, nice and slow. Keep your hand like a tray. Don't twist your arms around. Okay, now we're going to bring it out towards your shoulder. Do some abduction and adduction. Let me know if there's any pain. I'm going to do it three times. Again, you're still supporting the wrist and the elbow. Here we go. One. And we pause. Bring it back in. And two. Any pain, Mrs. Johnson? Let me take it in. Then one more time. And three. Doing good, doing good. Okay, we're going to cover you back up. Let me give you your call light in case you need to reach me. I'm going to put your bed back down to the lowest position for safety. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and remove your privacy curtain. Okay. Okay. Okay, so is there anything that I can do for you before I go? Okay, great. Thank you and um, have a great day. So I wash my hands, document the procedure, and the skill has been complete.